uh, on Twisted Big D and I got Alan. He took his test yesterday. We didn't have time to make a video, so we're going to ask him how his experience was. How was your experience? It was great, man. I, uh, it's definitely a life-changing experience, something I won't ever forget. He, his whole life he was told that he couldn't do this. He couldn't, you couldn't be a truck driver. His family told him that. His friends told him that. But look at him now. How was your test? Uh, it, it was great. I was nervous. I ain't gonna lie to you. Uh, I'm glad all the snow had melted. I had never seen snow here till I got here. It was negative 15 degrees last week. And then yesterday we was running around out here in t-shirts. Yeah. But, uh, it, it's definitely, it's a life changing experience for sure. And definitely work on your pre-trip. We, we had issues with pre-trip, but we studied, 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 and we got it down. Alan's came from a life of, you were in the special classes whenever you were younger short bus riders short bus riders he was in <laughs> he was in some of the special needs classes up until what the sixth grade you told me yes sir yes. the sixth grade and he decided that he wanted to go to regular school and be in the regular classes like you have to admire that the man's worked hard his whole life and he's got all the way to this point and he's worked hard to get his cdl like i admire that he's he didn't want to be take the easy route. He wanted to make sure that he earned everything that he's earned. And he's worked hard for me. He's he's very very dedicated to this. And he, I'm proud of him. He did a great job out there on this test. He's done a great job working with me. We had some rough times. We really had some rough times. We had a lot of learning to do. We had a, I had to figure out how to explain stuff to him. And we... We finally got to the same understanding, so he understood me, and we worked hard at it. It's like, I'm really proud of you. How many points did you get on your backing? Zero. How many points did you get on your drive? Two. Just two points on his drive, and they were, what, blinkers? Yes, sir. Blinkers. I had turned uh, my signal on uh, not soon enough. Not soon enough. Okay, so we didn't turn the blinker on far enough out, and pretty much a couple blinkers, little little bitty things, but... He did an awesome job. What do you think about all the people out here at Prime? I've met nothing but good people. People from all different cultures. Uh, a little bit of everybody out here. And uh, everybody's here to do the same thing, you know, to learn and get their CDL. And that was one of my problems. Whatever you think you know before you come out here, just squash that. And come out here with a clean plate and learn new and listen. That was my biggest problem. I did not know how to follow directions and listen and had questions every day. And that's just going <laughs> to mess you up even more just forget all your questions and just listen to your trainer that's the best advice i can give you and that took me a few days to do that and once i just started listening and not asking so many questions then things got a little better for me one day at a time one day at a time so and all i ever asked them was like let's improve just a little bit every day i'm looking for like maybe 10 percent improvement every day and every day we were improving by 10 percent 20 percent 30 percent we get got better and better and i'm i'm a pretty strict trainer so he's had to deal with some pretty strict stuff like i'm real strict on the driving i i need safe drivers and i'm real strict on it and you did awesome though i thank you big brother i just i'm oh, just glad welcome. you uh you got me through this and you know i made it man you know you made I, it. I, I went to you and you proved everyone wrong mm -hmm. He came in from his test and he talks to a lot of people so there were some people in the truck out there they were parked and they saw him coming they said hey did you pass your test he gave that thumbs up big smile everybody was cheering for him it was amazing he almost started crying on me like he was gonna start crying on me man I'm, if he starts crying i'm gonna cry too because it's i'm emotional. a crier you can't help it you know but he almost started crying and he was tearing up i was like don't do it don't do it i can't even look at you don't do it but we, we had an awesome time together. Big wrestling fan. He's a big wrestling fan. He loves wrestling. Hopefully someday I see him pulling those big wrestling trailers, get to go to all the events and set up the ring and stuff, hang out with some wrestlers. It'd be fun. But he did an awesome job out there. I'm, I cannot say, I cannot express how happy I am with him and what he's what it took for him to get to where he's at today. He's very, you were very motivated. And like I said, a, like I keep saying, I'm like extremely proud of you. And I know, I know that your dad would be proud of you. Thanks, big brother. He would. He yeah. always says the most important mile you ever drive is the next one. And the most dangerous places are parking lots. But uh, Big Al, you know, shout out to your dad. I love you. I miss you. 
So his dad, his dad drove a truck for the city, right? He drove a dump truck. Yes, a sir. dump truck for the city. So yes, you're kind of following any dad's footsteps, driving trucks. So you're out there doing it. He's getting ready for TNT. We're still waiting on a call for him to go on TNT. That's why he's still here today. He got his badge. You haven't got your free hat from the company store yet? I sure haven't. I need to go do that, don't I? That's what yeah, we're doing right there. Yeah, go get your free hat today. You earned it. Yes, sir. But that's Alan, and he's been a great student, and he, he wanted to share his experience he had out here in the PSD phase with everyone. So if you're looking to come to Prime, there's real life experience right here. We are not, we're not mean people. We treat you good. We're respectful. The food was good, right? Oh, the food was great. I've probably put on 20 pounds as I've been here. It's, uh, it's pretty cool to be able to eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner. You know, one thing I can tell you is you're not going to go hungry you're being out here. You're not going hungry. How was the hotel room? The uh, hotel room was great. I had heat, you know. <laughs> uh, but the hotels here are really nice. Uh, the, the maid staff is really nice. They keep your room really nice every day. Uh, everybody in the hotel there are really nice. I mean, nothing but good experiences. Great, great. And that's that's Alan. Uh, hit the subscribe button, like, comment. I gotta tell you one more thing though. You're always gonna be in my instructor for life. For Twisted life. D. Absolutely. You hold it down. And NWO. Too sweet. Too sweet. <laughs> Old trucking game. Check him out on his YouTube channel. All about trucking because we know that you want to be a trucker. Mm -hmm. And if you want to be a trucker, there's only one place to go. Bing. And head on over to Twisted. Twisted Big D. Twisted Big D?